Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel, which is the build 23580. In this build, we have some nice little improvements and also fixes for known issues in previous builds. So if you want to see all that, make sure to watch this video until the end. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with this video. First of all, regarding Copilot and Windows, start Starting with this build and the dev channel, users with local accounts will now be able to access Copilot and Windows for a limited number of queries before needing to sign in. And that is pretty nice. Also, Microsoft did some improvements to Windows Share. They significantly improved nearby share transfer speed for users on the same network. Before the changes, users had to be on the same private network, but now users just have to be on the same network, which could be public or private. You can quickly turn on nearby share via quick settings and simply right click on a local file in File Explorer choose share and choose to share to a device listed under nearby share in the windows share window microsoft also temporarily disabled the update of their color format to call rv1 that displayed richer emoji with a 3d like appearance to fix some bugs also in settings and then personalization under dynamic lighting microsoft reverted the description to the old one colors effects and brightness this was discovered by phantom machine 3 so shout out to him and we also have some improvements for voice access if we open up voice access and then close this guy then go to the help and then view all commands. You'll notice that we have a new feature that is currently hidden and can be enabled using Vive Tool, which is custom commands. Custom commands with custom commands feature. One can build a single voice command for recurring tasks, save time, and create command shortcuts for single action or a series of actions. If you click on create a new command, basically you can choose the command name, for example, open file explorer, and you have to select while using application, of course, and perform the current actions. Open file, open folder, open application, and then you have to choose the application that you want voice access to open. And then you can also add this command to a group. Click on save and you should have the new command that you can use using voice access. Also related to voice access, Japanese, Chinese, and Hindi were removed from the supported languages of voice access. And also German was added recently. All these things regarding voice access were discovered by Phantom Machine 3. So make sure to follow him on Twitter for more hidden features like these. Now let's talk about a few fixes. For example, related to the file explorer microsoft fiction issue where using mouse back and forward buttons didn't react when hovering over the recommended file section of home and they also fixed an issue where gallery would stop displaying correctly if you applied group by to all folders regarding desktops microsoft fiction issue that made the desktop tooltips and task view hard to read in contrast themes and they also fixed an issue that was causing taskbar icons to disappear after switching desktops regarding search on the taskbar they fixed an issue where if your taskbar was close to being full of icons and you use the search bar Box, clicking the search box would open search and then it would immediately close. And regarding Windows Spotlight, they fixed an issue which was resulting in Windows Spotlight wallpapers not showing correctly in the desktop thumbnail and task view. Basically, this is all there is to it to the latest dev channel build. Make sure to check out the article below if you want to learn more about known issues as well. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future authors like this one. I was Imani from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.